Hey, everybody in here, sitting in the tiny house, having my coffee. It's been rainy, rainy. Yesterday, it was just like dark all day long, and it's going to rain overnight and tomorrow really bad. We're supposed to have a bad storm come in. So I wanted to kind of get some, some garden issues kind of squared away um, because I just got to get that done. It's, you know, time's a-wasting, and I, I just got to be able to feel secure that I'm going to have good garden beds and that I'll be able to fill them with quality soil. I mean, they're mostly filled, but I'd actually like to build a couple more garden beds, so I don't know. I'm going to have to look around for resources because... And plus, that one in, in my front yard, that little brick one that I built, <sighs> since I'm keeping the puppies, I don't think there's any way I can keep them out of that, so I'm going to have to figure something out for that, too. But first, let's have some chicken TV. Hey, Miss Roxy. Pretty girl mama. Look at her. She's all healed up. Don't be mean. That's Splash. I love her. And Patsy. And Miss Chris, you gonna go broody again for me, girlfriend? Hi, Coco. And there's Beauty. Look at that funny looking comb. She beautiful. What's up, Romeo? Glad you're growing your tail feathers back, finally. They're up on their favorite hill to the Easter Eggers. Getting themselves a dust bath. Hey, bunnies. I see you already ate your morning grub. Oh my gosh. These bunnies are eating more and more and more. I'm having to go out like three times a day and uh, go and get them an assortment of greens. But I've got it plentiful. They are just growing like weeds. And there's, there's Daddy Bunny. Oh no, that might be Mama. Um, I'm gonna keep the buck and one doe, the, probably the biggest doe, and uh, use her to breed. And then we'll just see what happens. There. Just a couple handfuls for lunch. It'll tide you over. I'm such a goofball. I keep forgetting these are the last of this size board that um, Miss Donna B brought down for me. Um, I use a different kind for the shelves. These are thicker. They're, they're sturdier. Um, and I think that they would make some nice garden boxes. So I'm going to try and see if I can do that today. You all know how bad at building I am, but really all I need to do is put some screws in it. So I think I can accomplish that and then put, huh, I'm not even going to bother with the weeds. I'm just going to put cardboard down in the bottom and then start building them up. Well, hello there, Scarlet. Oh, I feel so bad with the way your back looks, but it is getting better. This girl just likes to stay by herself. Yeah, this whole area somehow some way is going to have to be enclosed I don't know I mean those two are <laughs> kind of enclosed I mean just enough to keep the chickens out maybe I can do the same sort of thing with these I think that's enough cardboard and remember the cardboard will break down go into the soil over time I took off all the stuff with the adhesive on it so hopefully I won't get weeds up so now I gotta go check and see if the power drill is charged up. I got them done. <sighs> and it is hot out here, if you can believe it. It's like 80, only 80 degrees, but the sun is beating down on me. So, yeah, I just made a square thing. And they actually turned out pretty gosh darn square. I just pre-drilled holes and pre-drilled the screws and uh, put them together. And these may not seem very tall to you. But uh, they're going to be tall enough because um, I'm going to mound the dirt up. I'm not convinced this is where I'm going to put them. 
I just wanted to kind of flush it out a little bit, but they're together. These will make two more really nice garden boxes. And uh, I may end up just putting them over here. Um, I just don't remember how the sun is out here, and I don't want to block the sun from anything over there. So I may just end up putting them over there. I don't know. I'm just going to have to decide. But, uh, yeah, those made some really nice raised bed garden boxes. Phew, I had to come inside the tiny house to cool off. Yes, come inside the tiny house to cool off. This uh, insulation is making a difference in the heat because, I mean, it's like only 80 degrees outside. It may feel like 83 because of the humidity, but anyhow, I had to come in, make myself a little lemonade, and there's something wrong, something going on with Beauty. Um, I was out working on the boxes, and I saw her just kind of like plop down in the yard, taking a little nap all by herself. And uh, so I went over to her, I picked her up, and she she reminded me when I picked up Nispra's fancy pants when she was broody. She'd draw her legs up and got herself all flattened out and she wouldn't even move. But I kind of tested both of her legs and one of her legs seemed, I don't know, it seemed like there was something wrong with it. I couldn't see any injuries. There was no blood, no feather loss, nothing like that. Um, so I just picked her up, brought her in the yard. And um, she just kind of sat down like she wanted to go broody. So I put her in the back on top of a bunch of eggs. And there it's, that's where she stayed. And she's just kind of like in a trance. Remember how Miss Pris was just kind of like, kind of like that? That's the way the beauty is. So I don't know if there's something wrong with her or she's sick or she's going broody. But we're going to find out. She's got like 15, 16 eggs underneath of her. Because I didn't collect the eggs yesterday and all those hens are going in there trying to lay eggs. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I hope she's okay. She's one of my favorite hens. Anyhow, um, so I'm just going to take a break here for a little bit. i got to go into town. Ugh, I don't feel like going into town. I really don't want to go into town. But there's Papa being a good boy. As usual, he knows I'm talking about him. UPS just pulled up and dropped me off this. So, I'm going to tear into it and see what it is. Wish list! Two $25 tractor supply company gift cards. Oh my gosh! Who sent it? There's there's no note! I don't know who sent it! Whoever you are, thank you so much. I'm going to go put this in my account right now and then I'm going to start ordering stuff because I, I need dog food, I need chicken food, I need chicken bedding, I need... I need a lot of stuff, but this is definitely going to help. Thank you so much, whoever you are. If you want to if you want to be identified, let me know down in the comment section. Oh, you are just a, your lifesaver. Thank you. I got to go into town. I don't want to, but I have to. I need toilet paper. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.